uh, glossary uh, work. Um, I'm going to play you some pieces which have those terms in. Um, and just, just to show you an example of those terms. First one is the um, is is auto is major and minor. So a good piece to play would be the Game of Thrones theme tune, um, in which it alternates between a minor key and a major key. Starts with G minor. Then a few a few bars later, the E flat becomes an E natural, and then it becomes a major key. diminished sevenths and for this one I'm going to be on the violin um, and I'm going to be play, playing um, something you have to do uh, uh, in the scales of arpeggio grade 5 uh, onwards I think um, and what you do you play the diminished seventh of the starting note um, but you play it uh, broken so the one that I'm doing starts on G on the piano you could play it all in one go and it will sound like this but as you hear on the violin I'll play it e each note individually and it, um, it will be two octaves chords and I thought for this one I'd play um, a great one of my grade four pieces it's a morning prayer by Tchaikovsky and it's sort of uh, written in the way that you'd expect a choir a choir piece to be written there's, there's, in each hand you play two notes most, the, most of the piece and then the same in the left hand so it'd be soprano or tenor bass so it's sort of four parts in a way and once they're played together they make some very nice chords so I thought I'd just play the first bit uh, just so you can hear here so it's quite, some quite nice chords Sando, uh, which I'm going to do on my violin again, and it's probably probably quite uh, easier to do glissando on uh, the violin than on the piano. Um, it's going to play a piece. It's a piece from one of my old technique books. It's very short. It's it's a Hebridean piece, and it involves uh, quite a glissing um, from first to third position. It's quite a book I found from quite a long time ago, but I thought it'd be nice to have uh, a some sort of piece to be able to show uh, glissando in. <laughs> chromatic scale which I'll play on the violin. Actually I'll play on the piano first to compare. Um, on the violin um, to play a chromatic scale um, you use uh, fingers, all your fingers and for each note you, you um, for fingers one and two you slide um, you, you use the same finger for two notes um, so like it's mine this one starts on G so you do G you do the um, a, a flat with one A with one B flat with two B with two then C with three, 
and then generally do the C sharp with four, then you go on the open string, you do the same thing. So normally one, one, two, two, three, four, then you go on the next one. That's in uh, that's probably that's the, the general way you do it on the violin. On the piano, it's probably quite easier on the piano. You use the fingers one, two, and three. So let's say start on C. You do one, three, one, three, two, one, three. fingers one and three when you're going between black white black white but once you've got two white notes together you incorporate finger two so, so you don't have to so it's a lot easier and you can get back into the half pattern doing one three on the um one three when you get on the white and black notes again um then i'll play i'll, I'll play on the violin just to show you as I've, and i'll use the technique as i explained earlier <laughs> trill and for this one I'm going to be on the violin as it's probably yeah I find it's, as it's quite good for me uh, as it's, it's you can do a trill on the on the piano as well but I like doing uh, ones on the violin so I'll sh play a quick extract of one of my grade six pieces which does have uh, quite a, which does have uh, trills in it Uh, listening to those sort of um, these pe those pieces, and also those um uh, just showing off the untechnical the um, uh, the, the terms. Um, I hope you didn't enjoy um, watching that. It might have been a bit different to the other things that you might have to um mark. I, I do hope that you and your family are all doing well during this uh, situation, and I do hope you've enjoyed listening.